And Lizzie, this has been flagged for some time. It is still significant, of course, gives her that head headroom in terms of investments. Why, why then is the Chancellor making this move? Has she faced some pushback? Well, what she's specifically doing is changing how debt is measured so that she can maintain the golden rule of only borrowing uh, to invest and funding day-to-day -day spending with tax revenues. Now, she's towing this line between maintaining fiscal credibility, not returning to austerity, and not raising taxes on working people. It's a really tight set of limitations they've given themselves to get elected, and therefore it is absolutely crucial that Labour can convince the markets that this borrowing is going to stimulate growth, hence why she's doing all the pitch rolling. She's done this speech at the IMF in Washington there was a Guardian story, there's been an opinion piece in the Financial Times, and yet you still saw this market wobble yesterday. The yield on 10-year gilts falling, the spread between gilt and bunt yields widening, and that's because of the prospect of increased borrowing leading markets to pair bets on the scope for BOE rate cuts, despite Andrew Bailey saying, look, disinflation is happening, and he had already said that that was a condition for more aggressive cuts. So what you can see is this guilt move is more of a fiscal story than directly a monetary one.